Hey everyone, so today I am filming a video somewhere completely different. I'm actually sitting on my bed instead of sitting at my desk. My camera may shake a little bit because it's balancing on my bed, actually balancing on my computer. So, <laughs> this is pretty interesting. I actually think this is lopsided, but I'm Italian, so who cares? Um, <laughs> what I wanted to do today was actually talk about um, what I carry in my purse. Um, what's on my purse, what is my purse, and what's inside my purse. Now, I did just recently load it up just because um, some stuff has happened and I needed a lot of crap. But first thing I guess I should say is this is a 31 purse. I work for that company. Um, it's a Miles Style. Miles of Style. Miles of Style. Sorry. Uh, Jewel by 31 is amazing. It does not come with this strap, but um, it comes with like a longer strap and I just got tired of it So I took my diamond district, which is also a 31 purse and took the strap off of it and put it on here Because I like to be odd um, Now I have this one here, which is technically a coin purse I have like probably six million of these from 31 because I collect them. I think they are amazing um, they're useful for many things. I used to put my wallet in here, or my cards in here, so this was just my wallet. Right now I use this for treats for my dog Bandit, and it just hangs on my bag, which is awesome. And then I also have a, um, Maleficent keychain. I'm not sure, because I, I think these are like Disney figurals or whatever. I was in, uh, Toys R Us looking for some stuff, and I saw these, and I'm like, oh, hey, I wonder if they have a Maleficent. I look in the box to see like if they have any and all of the bags were actually open and I see Maleficent sitting right there and I'm like oh okay I'm just gonna buy this somebody opened it they're gonna get rid of it anyways I'll buy it um so it doesn't go to waste now it does have a little bit of damage to it I'm not sure if I did it or if whoever opened it did it because I really this has been sitting on my desk because I don't know I don't have it on my purse I didn't have it on my purse for a while so that's like the outside of my purse. Oh, 31 Jewel loves doing this. They put this little pocket here and you can fit your phone in here. I use it for like different, all sorts of different stuff. I put my phone in here, I put my school ID in here. Um, I don't know, I put numerous amounts of crap in it. So, okay, that's the actual purse. Now what's inside of it is completely different. First off, I have this, which is the Mini Uptown by 31. I think everything in my purse is 31, um, except for like different electronics or something. But this is a 31 product. I love it. Uh, this is the purple dancing dot. Um, I don't know if that's in this catalog because we just switched catalogs. But I love this color. I know the navy dancing dot is, but. I love this color and I love how like small it is that I can fit it in like the randomest places. Inside I have my sunglasses from Del Sol which I don't know it's not very sunny today. I don't know if I can get them well we'll see. They change in the sunlight so I'm like holding them at my window. Yeah I don't think it did anything. Maybe a little bluer. They become really, really blue. Um, then also in here, I have my little charging thing because I have an iPhone. I have everything Apple. And then um, I have two different cords because I have an iPad, iPod Classic, which is also in this little awesome little thing. So I have my iPod Classic charger and then I have my iPad and iPhone charger in here as well and they're like wrapped together just really neatly which doesn't always happen um then I have two pens that are also styluses this one is like the stylus on this end and then like there's that but this one is the stylus here and then the pen just sort of comes up this one my mom got me um I think everybody in my family has one of these and then I bought this one myself because I needed one for school and I couldn't find this one at the time. And then, okay, like I said, I have a lot of Apple products. 
this case is like my sister got me ones from like this flea market that aren't like real apple um so like i guess knockoffs whatever but they're the same design that i like and like they are my favorite colors so it works out for me but that's this case and the ones inside of it actually are my real apple ones and i just didn't want them to get damaged because they were expensive i think they were like 40 dollars when i first bought them I'm not sure it was either 40 or 30 um my mom bought these for me um and then i got another pair with my iphone and those i think broke right away or they're somewhere at my house i don't know but then I have the generic brand, which they're just loose just because it's like whatever. And then the last thing in this little thing, this thing holds a lot, is my little pocket knife. I just use it to like open things. Um, I'm not one of those people who sits there and like plays with it or tries throwing it at somebody. I'm not very good at looking at it. Okay, how was that little pouch? Um, I guess we'll go into books because I have like three books. This one. I love owls. You're gonna, you, you've seen the owl on my front, but um, this is a passion planner. I talked about this in my college resources or my school resources. I love it, but this is owl stickers and then a Maleficent Zoom Zoom sticker, and then like if you've never seen a passion planner, you need to like get one. They're amazing. I love it to death, and they make it easier every day because they give you like different tips if you follow them on Instagram, which. I do because I have Instagram and I love finding out when the sales are, when new things are released. It's amazing. And then my other thing is my iPad mini, which I love. It's it's nice because like there's days that I want to carry my computer and then there are days that I just want to take my iPad. And it's a lot easier. But out case, love this out. I used to have a case for like this for my phone. But it was for my old phone, not my new phone. I had a Samsung Galaxy, now I have an iPhone. So, yeah. Um, I have this, this color Zen thing. Um, I have anxiety. I'm saying um a lot because I had a really bad day. And I'm just like filming this because like this usually makes me feel a little bit better. Um, but I color because it's like, people are like, oh, it's a little kiddish. I don't think so. It's a, it's a very good way of releasing stress. I don't know if I have it here. But I did one this morning because I was like really, really stressed out. And um, it's not it's not great. But I like just love doing this kind of stuff. And it's very helpful for me. Oh, I just realized I left a whole... Oh, because I never finished it. I need to finish this. But it's very helpful. My mom found this little small book and got it for me. And then can't go anywhere without colored pencils my best friend remembered that I said something about coloring that it helps me and he got me a coloring book color pencils and a sketchbook which I believe was so amazing I was so ecstatic when he gave me that for Christmas um and I loved loved it and I still use all of that these pencils are amazing I have these that stay in my purse and then I have um different ones for like when I'm at home or something and I want to do like drawing or something um I just realized my subway card is loose but here's my wallet it's also 31 it's an old one it's a just a 31 wristlet and my phone fits perfectly here I love that but this is chains of Hoy, I think and this is a very old print and it's actually retired I think this even the style is retired like we have switched so much we are now going from a lot of like cloth to uh leather so like we have now six wrists no not six wow three wristlets that are leather and i think we have like one that is non-leather or pleather whatever it is i i never asked if it was actual real leather or not <sighs> i have little pieces of paper in here little note oh i have business cards my business cards I also have this, which I just recently got. I'm still learning how to work it. It's a smartwatch. Um, I don't know. I don't really use it, I guess, I'm because I just got it a few days ago, and I'm still learning how to work it. It's awesome, but I don't know what I'd do with it. 
because I have to have Bluetooth earphones and I just found out my earphones do not work anymore. So now I have to go and buy new Bluetooth earphones. Or I just have to use my Bluetooth. I do not know what this is and I don't want to know what it is. And then um, I have tons of markers and pens at the bottom of my purse. Got little pieces of paper. I'm not going to show you the inside of my purse because there's um, some women stuff in here. Got mint. Oh, hey, I got change. Um, okay, this. So I have all these markers. These are frictions, and they are amazing. They are markers that you can write with and then erase with. I love them. You have to order them on Amazon or eBay because they ship from Japan. I don't know why I love Japan stuff. Japanese stuff. This is Bandit's, um, he's snoring, so if you hear him, well, it's his trachea. But this is Bandit's badge for when, um, we go somewhere new that doesn't know that he is my service dog. And then it also, on the back, I just created that he's a service dog in training because of the fact that I'm still working on a few things with him. And it says, please ask before petting. Um, a lot of people just pet him out, out of random, even though he's a service dog and people know that you're not supposed to pet service dogs, they still pet them. And that irritates me. Well, that's me. One thing I am going to show you inside my purse, 31, or Jewel, Jewel, because Jewel by 31 Com was a combination of two companies but this is like this purse can only have one but other ones can have like two and it's just like a pocket that snaps in um just little snaps and there's different ones there's like a slit one where there's three little holes or there's this where there's just like a big pocket now this is where my pens and stuff are supposed to be so i probably have to put them in here but i just realized that um my church, when we did Easter, we did this nail thing, and all of the nails that my father had handed me are in here still. So I need to get rid of those. But this purse, I, I've had it for about three, four weeks, and I really like it, and I keep a lot of stuff in it. And it holds up. I like that it's leather because I like the whole sophisticated look of leather, even though... Um, I'm a college student and I really shouldn't have leather um, or I shouldn't even look sophisticated yet but this will help me out tomorrow because I have a conference I have to go to which is part of the reason my bag is getting reloaded with stuff it's adding another thing of this a little notebook so I can take notes on different conference or different things that I'm going to and I'm not excited about this at all because this is a very small notebook, but hopefully it'll work. And it's called Arc by Staples. They are amazing if you do not have one. This is amazing. So that's what's inside my purse. I You're going to see this outfit again because I'm going to film one about what's inside my college backpack. Um, and that stuff is basic. I should probably could put it in this. We're just going to do that. We're just going to do that. That'll be easier. If I can move all my stuff. Because literally, it's so easy. This is my backpack. It's a Jansport something. I don't know. But I love it. It is absolutely fantastic. I ne For the longest time, I did not know there was a pocket here. And I recently found that there there is. Um, I have doggy bags. I have treats in here chapstick and I have an old newspaper and then this pocket I just don't really use it very much it's just there I used to keep my car keys in there just because it was nice um okay what is it my awesome little pencil case I love this thing it I like it also because right in this pocket, my phone fits, and a lot of times I can keep this out on my desk and sit there and play on my phone while the teacher thinks that I'm sitting there looking at my pencils. It's pretty nice. Naive teachers, do not repeat anything I do, because it can be bad. And then here's my, another ARC notebook uh, for all my classes that I use notes for. Uh, this used to be fatter, but I took out a lot of my notes because it was getting way too ridiculous. And then, 
It used to be a small one, and I don't know why I put a big one in here. So I have my perfume in here as well. I have some loose pens and pencils in here. And then, of course, the nights that I am unsure if I am safe, I have pepper spray. I'm going to steal that. Put that in my purse. Um, and apparently there's Tic Tacs in here and uh, a journal. But, like, yeah, that's that's pretty basic. I like it. Um, I used to carry around a 31 backpack as well. And, I don't know, I it got on my nerves. It started dislocating my shoulder pretty easily. I thought it was, like, everything I was carrying, so I started limiting down what I carry. And then I found out it was the way, like, I had to hold my backpack. So I decided to go with a regular uh, two-shoulder backpack that's actually padded. Um, now, like, I'm not saying 31 bad or anything, like, I work for them, but the only problem I had with the backpack was it was dislocating my shoulder, and my shoulder is actually very weak, so, like, simple things can dislocate my shoulder. I can easily throw out my back even now, and it's ridiculous. I'm only 20, and I can do all this, but it's, it was a good bag. I loved it, but I couldn't handle it anymore, so I got transport. And I love my Jansport. It is amazing. I love that it doesn't hurt when I carry it. Um, and it doesn't like weigh me down. I carried a lot in it. And it, do it doesn't ever feel like it has a lot in it. Um, so yeah. That's what's in my bag right now. <laughs> Trust me. I've had numerous more things in bags before. Um, Bandit himself has actually been in my both my purse and my backpack he's like right there um he's like holding my purse up right now or and sleeping but he has been in every single bag I've ever carried and it's amazing he just lays in there but 31 is a great company if you ever want uh, to either hear more know more uh leave a comment hit me up tell me what's inside your purse if you want to completely up to you like and share the video, subscribe if you aren't already subscribed, and let me know if there's something in my bag that you think is completely weird that's in my bag, or something you've never thought about carrying that I have, or something you think I should carry that I don't have. I don't care, I always add different little things, so just let me know, and I hope you guys have a great day. I will see you next time.